Good morning, Adam here. Um, I'm actually out walking around to the garage, gonna try and get an MOT in for the car. And uh, I had a hot cup of tea. And I do a very special walk and tea and talk. <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, but yeah, what is there to talk about? What's uh, grabbed my attention? Well, morning story, just breaking at the moment. So, you know, not too much detail out, but um, saw a headline in the newspaper, John Lewis thinking of ditching annual bonus for first time. It's like, oh my gosh, why are they ditching their annual bonus? And as with a lot of headlines, take a look and yeah, it's, it's one of those frustrating stories. They're not ditching the bonus. They're still keeping their annual bonus scheme. Um, but the thing is, they have had disappointing trading. Christmas sales were down like for like sales. I think we had was it, down 1.8%, which is a big deal for a company like for like so that's ignoring stores that have opened or closed you know and bringing in new revenue that you can't compare how did the same stores that were open last year compare to what they did this year so yeah things are a little difficult there was a little throwaway thing in there like they, they're meeting their profit expectations but um what they're saying is that the partnership board are going to meet and they are going to consider whether or not a payout is justified in the circumstances and one of the reasons that I think it's worth talking about this is there is a lot of misunderstanding about um, John Lewis's bonus scheme a lot of people uh, rightly um, sort of know it's kind of a flagship annual bonus scheme that it's a really good example of uh, of a bonus in sort of engaging with people but then people aren't really clear about why and to put it very simply, it's not an annual bonus scheme like you or I might understand. It's actually, um, well, it's a partnership bonus. Well, and what's different about a partnership bonus? Well, the see the thing is, everyone who works for John Lewis is a partner in the business. So they're not employees. It is establishing that you are equal members of the organization and therefore have a right to equal share in the profit of the organization and actually everybody has a target bonus of 20 percent of their annual earnings and that includes the most lowly member of the shop floor to the ceo they are all on a 20 percent target bonus top profitability everybody shares but the thing is an annual bonus scheme is no good if there is no baseline for it a bonus is a bonus it's an extra um, you are demonstrating that you are sharing in the profitability of the organization and if profits are struggling then no you might not pay it out but the most important thing that this story is missing is that it is the partnership board that will decide it it is not an elite group of execs on an entirely separate a uh, bonus plan you know no one is being sort of cheated out of it it sends a message as it always does every year we are all in this together we are all partners and if things have been disappointing and there's no bonus yes we are all disappointed and we need to do better but we are all in this together so they're not ditching their annual bonus they may not have hit criteria that justifies paying a bonus but they are all partners in it together all right, well, thank you very much. I'm nearly at the garage, so I wish you adieu. Cheerio.